Ben and Jerry's is getting roasted online for tweeting what some are calling an anti-American 4th of July message. Here's what they wrote. This 4th of July, it's high time we recognize that the U.S. exists on stolen indigenous land and commit to returning it. Are we all supposed to be going back to Europe? That's my question, everybody. Okay. Wow. The company claims parades, barbecues, and fireworks distract from this, quote, essential truth about this nation's uh, birth. Adam, boy, if I was a shareholder in Ben and Jerry's, and I'm obviously not... Right. And they're not public, but my point being, I'm well, not tone deaf. They just gave me a reason not to buy Ben & Jerry's. <laughs> I stopped buying Nike when Nike decided it was going to support those who kneel during the national anthem. I literally yeah. haven't bought a single Nike thing since they did that. We have to I, run, but Joel Petlin, he's his professor, he said, speaking of stolen land at Ben & Jerry's, how about the land underneath your headquarters that you're yeah, occupying in Vermont? Thank you. Why don't you return that stolen thank land? Thank you. And then name your next flavor, shameful hypocrisy crunch.